Suppose that a radioactive isotope has a half-life of 2,450 years. Write a function that models the amount of the isotope remaining after t years. So since we have a, since it has a half-life, that indicates that we have exponential decay. I will use uh, the exponential function of the form uh, p of t equals some p sub 0 e to the kt to model this function. The p sub 0 is the initial amount. Now we don't have an initial amount here. So let's just leave it alone. Let's leave the initial amount as that p sub 0. But we're told that it has a half-life of 2,450 years. So that means that when t, uh, when t is 2,450, the output for the function must be one half of the initial amount, one half of the p naught. So substituting those values, we can solve for k. So P, P sub 0, e to the k times 2,450 would equal 1 half of P sub 0. Let's solve this for k. I divide through by the P sub 0. So then e to the 2,450k is equal to 1 half. Half-life, there's a 1 half as the resulting factor. All right, now we want to solve for k. Let's convert this to logarithmic form. Since our base is e, we apply the natural log. So 2,450 k is equal to the natural log of 1 half. And then dividing through by 2,450, k would equal the natural log of 1 half divided by 2,450. And that's an exact value for k. Let's approximate it. So let's bring up the calculator. Yeah, let's see what we have here. So let's, uh, 1 half is 0.5. Uh, let's apply the natural logarithm to that. So I have that number. And let's divide that by 2,450. All right, so we see, I see this output and my on this calculator and this e negative 4 at the end, this tells me that this is in scientific notation. So um, negative, and there's, we move the decimal four places, so negative 0 Let me make sure I got that right. Okay, it looks good. So then there's my k value. And so a function that models this situation would be p of t equals p naught e to the negative 0.0002829t. And you gotta be careful here, don't don't round uh, if you're in that if you're in a situation where you need to use this. Don't round that k value too much. Um, all right. So there's our function.